Good morning! Welcome to my vlog today. Today is a different type of day because Dove is actually not here this morning and I'm gonna get right into that. But first, we're gonna have a little bit of a breakfast. Good morning, Kuma. Good morning, Hero. Our set is still set up there from my last shooting and Leo is over here. Hello, hello. Making breakfast. So I have I just feel like a new person. Every time I get actual like full night's rest, I feel like a new person. The first thing I want to address is why Dove is not here. New mom here. Hello. People talk about how hard it is, like how like the lack of sleep is going to really catch up to you. It's been nine weeks now. It really does catch up to you and you really don't feel like a human after a while of not sleeping through the night for nine weeks. It's so important as a new parent to get help. When people say it takes a village to raise a child, it really absolutely does take a village and you need to find your village. Even if it's just like talking about your mental health with you know, someone that understands, like a parent, it really matters. I'm just so grateful for my mom and my dad who is here. They live 10 minutes away and they are our village. And they are so generous in taking my baby overnight so that we can catch up on some sleep and also get a little bit of work done. You look, you look good. Sure. Can I cut your hair though? Yeah, thank you. That looks like a hearty breakfast. is affecting me and basically my, what mom guilt is I feel guilty when I'm not giving my a hundred percent time and concentration to my baby but that's just like impossible to do like as a person I still need to refrain a little bit of personal time and and literally I felt bad for buying myself a nice bag because I was like oh I need to save that for my baby but it's like no, 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 girl, like you make enough money where you can treat yourself. You work so hard. You've literally pushed out a baby. This is my push present. I was like hesitant to get it for myself. And I think another thing that's really important is self-care. I think it's so easy to forget to like, I mean, it's not forgetting. Sometimes you don't even have time to do it, to brush your hair or brush your teeth. But something that I always, always do no matter what is my skincare routine. And today, this video is actually sponsored by Enough Project. I am so thankful for them for adding their skincare into my life because I've started trying out these products and actually I'm really impressed with the ingredients that they have in there. It is vegan and cruelty free and they use no colorants in their products. One of the things that I really love, if you guys watched my last video, in my skincare routine is retinol. In their moisture cream, they have Bacuchiol. It does similar things as retinol, but the chemical buildup of it is actually a lot more stable. So Bacuchiol is really, really great for your skin and preserving the youthfulness and diminishing wrinkles. It is their all-in-one essence. And I'm just going to pop that all over my face right now before I do my makeup. Keep my morning skincare very, very minimal. I use this Enough Project Moisture Cream. Since I've started using it, I really enjoy it. And this is how I remain sane as a new mom. I try to take care of myself as well as I can. I'm not going to be harsh on myself on days like I don't have time for skincare and just need a knockout, but I try to keep it as minimal as possible. So we actually have to install the car seat in this car right now because our Tesla is getting a checkup. Hello, look who we got here. Hi, Dubby. Do you want to see yourself? Say hi. Yeah. Hi, everyone. We're on our way home right now. Can we still go to get a car wash, babe? No, I don't think so. Okay. He's gone way out. 
Okay, yeah, because we have um, an appointment for HVAC adulting things. We're getting up. Let's go, sissy. Yeah. Oh. I think it's time for a nap, isn't it? She usually has a nap right about now. And if she's not napping, she is in her baby Bjorn. Excuse me, hero. Hey, Google. Turn downstairs to cool. Got it. Changing downstairs to cool. Oh my god, it's so much. How are you? Is it dirty? It's, yeah, look at that. Yeah, it's dirty. It's very <laughs> dirty. Oh, we gotta change her diaper too. So this is what I use to trim her nails down. I actually use this nail filer that's made for babies. Her nails are really sharp right now, so we're gonna file them down. And they don't hurt her. Another harsh truth of being a new mom is it's kind of funny to think of it this way But you're literally taking care of The most selfish person that you can take care of in your whole life And it's okay because it's your cute sweet little baby I literally dropped it twice on the ground before I was able to get it clean You want it? Close all the blinds, yeah. So you can see. Finally asleep. I think she's on her second or third nap of the day, and we're gonna have our lunch. This is how we're watching her right now. This is what we're eating for lunch. My mom actually made some fried rice, um, and she gave us fried rice in this Yelp Plat original tub. You know you're Asian if you save stuff like this. Hey Google, turn downstairs to off. She's sad. Okay, I'm gonna go now. Baby, she is sad. I'm coming, baby. No, I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, sweetie pie. <laughs> Turns out she's not hungry. She doesn't want any milk, and this is what she wants. She wants to be on the shoulder. Be. This is what you want. This makes you happy. There's no more crying dove. She's happy. She's happy again. <laughs> you have your daddy's eyes and your daddy's eyebrows. Oh. 
Hi, baby. Okay, so we figured out what the problem was. She just wanted to be soothed. Oh my god, you're so happy right now. Uh, Hi, uh, baby. Would you like a book? She's been liking this one right here. It's called Never Touch a Spider. Uh, or should we do some tummy time? You're okay. You're okay. Oh my god, you're so strong now. Can you lift your head up? Yes, you can. You can do it, baby. Hi, baby. You can do it. Yeah. <gasps> Good girl. Oh my god. You did it. I'm so proud of you. Good girl. See? Oh my goodness. You're so strong. Yes, baby. <laughs> you did it. So I got her these books. This one is called Papa Learns Chinese. Do you want to read, baby? Let's read together. Say hi to YouTube. Say hi, YouTube. It's called Papa Learns Chinese. She loves to do this. It's one of her favorite things to do. Yeah, this one has two pandas. Leo is holding her right now. I'm trying to put her to sleep. <laughs> she keeps sitting up. That's a, every time Leo puts it back in her mouth. I am going to finish doing my makeup because we're going to go to this COVID-friendly outdoor mall in Costa Mesa. It's called the Anti Mall that I found on TikTok. Daddy's got it under control. Okay. All right. This is actually the Kony baby carrier. I love this so much. I actually bought, my whole family has a total of four Kony carriers. This, as you can tell, is super effective. And now I can get back to getting ready. She's so relaxed in here now. <laughs> and it's mesh so she can still breathe really well in here too. It is now 4 p.m. and I'm gonna check in on my family to see if they wanna go to the outdoor mall. We just finished at the lab and we are now at the Mitsua Mall. Um, my parents were craving some ramen and I also would like some ramen. We have baby here is trying to talk with you too. She loves talking, right? Okay, I just took a shower. Finally got Dove to go to sleep. Next, I'm gonna use the all-in-one essence to moisturize my face. That concludes my day in life with a new mom. Um, I realized that this is a lot different than my everyday life. I don't usually go out. Um, I usually stay home and have the same routine with Dove where I feed, burp, put her to sleep, she cries. I needed something different. We've been doing this for over nine weeks now and I am 
just going a little bit crazy, stir crazy with COVID and everything and not much to do. So this was a much needed, a little excursion for me. And I had such a great time today with my family. Thank you so much for riding along. And if you guys want to check out my last video of me, like surviving the first month with my baby, um, feel free to check that video out and subscribe if you want. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.